Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you how to get your very own RDP using a free online service. Yes, it's possible, but before we start, grab a cup of coffee, sit back and maybe stretch a bit. Because this is going to take a little time and trust me, patience is your new best friend. Step 1. Accessing the link. Alright, first things first, go to the link in the description. Don't worry, I won't make you do a treasure hunt. It's right there. Once you're on the page, click that shiny Cloud Smarter button. Boom! A new window opens. Now, it's going to ask you to sign in. And here's the trick. You need a GitHub account. So, log in with your GitHub credentials. Don't have an account? Well, shame on you. Just kidding. You can make one. It's free and fast. Step 2. Creating the project. Once signed in, click Create New Project. Easy, right? Now, during project creation, select a random blank template. Don't overthink it. We're just going to turn this into a terminal playground anyway. After it opens, find and click Sandbox. This is where the magic happens. Basically, this is your terminal. Don't panic if it looks like the matrix. We're in control. Step 3. Running commands. Now comes the fun part. Running commands. Follow exactly what I do in the video. You'll see me typing stuff that probably looks like ancient hacker code, but don't worry, it's all safe. Warning, it takes some time. So, maybe do a little dance while waiting, or talk to your cat, or just hum your favorite tune. Patience, grasshopper. Patience. Step 4. Giving a port. Once the commands finish, we need to give a port number. Think of it like giving your new RDP its own little home address in the internet world. Don't skip this step. Your RDP won't know where to live. Step 5. Exposing TCP using Pingy. Next up, go to the website Pingy. This is where we expose the TCP port so we can access our RDP from anywhere. Follow exactly what I do. Yes, copy my moves like a dance tutorial, step by step. Once the TCP is exposed, congratulations. You now have a fully working remote desktop and you didn't even have to pay a single penny. Give yourself a pat on the back, or a high five, or both. Funny commentary throughout. If your screen starts freezing, don't panic. It's just the RDP testing your patience. Remember, Control plus C is your best friend if things go wrong. Treat it like a superhero cape. Yes, it looks complicated now, but by the end of this video, you'll be the boss of free RDPs. Outro. And that's it. If you followed the steps carefully, you now have your very own free RDP. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment below what crazy thing you're going to do with your new remote desktop. Remember, patience is key. Follow the steps exactly and never forget. Hacking, I mean exploring, is fun. Catch you in the next one.